Hello everyone and welcome to Crypto Dex. Maybe you want to join the Illuminati. Not that one. We're going to talk about Lumen Coin today. Let's jump right in. Hello everyone. Welcome to Lumen. Now before we get started on this, this is a really cool project. I just want to let you know that I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. Please do your own research, due diligence, and do not invest in anything you're not willing to lose. So we've all heard of it. The Illuminati. Does it exist? Is it a secret thing? Well, this one is quite apparent. I'm really excited for it. The Illuminati Lumen Coin is the world's first cryptocurrency that facilitates direct democracy over monetary policies. So what does that mean? In, in terms of that, what it means is any monetary policies, anything to do with monetary fluctuation, like raising interest, inflation, things like that, that central banks do, Lumen is going to counteract that. So you can propose and vote on different policies on the chain, and then you can make changes. So it's completely decentralized. You make the actual monetary changes. Imagine that. If you could go to your bank and say, oh, I'd, I'd like you to um, increase interest on CDs or something like that. So it improves on banking. And old cryptos, the monetary path is usually decided from the dev to the start. The, de the dev creates it and says, hey, here's the tokenomics. Boom, boom, boom. Here's the amount. Here's what we're going to do. Here's how we're going to do that. And as such, that's just how it goes. You don't have much of a say in it. It's not really community driven. So just to really sum it up, what Lumen is, is the one currency where you and other people determine your own monetary future. It's in your hands. The team has also different plans for marketing things like NFTs and enterprise stuff. And you can also vote, be delegated, and be part of this actual process. And they're going to be inviting some big names, some professors, journalists, and people who can vote on chain. So th this could literally be, this project that I'm showing you right now, could be the best DAO, Decentralized Autonomous Organization. That's how it works. Everybody who's part of it actually gets a say. And the nice thing is it has good security. It's been audited by Interfi, which is probably one of the best auditors on Pink Sale. And the audit is you know, going to be complete in a couple of days. So that's going to make sure that investors, if you're looking at this project and saying, well, I want to make sure the security is good. It is. And the token codes are also verified and viewable on BSC scan. So now saying the different things, what is here? We got the Doge. We got Tian Shan, if you're familiar with Dragon Ball Z, Beyonce, <laughs> you know, Vitalik Buterin, and some interesting art, cute anime girl, and Elon Musk, as well as Marvel. So, some pop culture icons, and the community rules are simple. Join the Illuminati. Do not admit to being in the Illuminati. It's like Fight Club. First rules, we don't talk about Fight Club. And help build a world with better democracy and freedom. Now, this is going to be good because it's going to be quite simple. I have the token name here. You can see the supply, the liquidity, the stakers over two years, and the rest period. And they have the DD DAO, the Direct Democracy DAO. So this is not your typical decentralized autonomous organization. This is what I want to hit on. Now, it's still being developed, the UI is. But the idea is that anyone can submit proposals on chain to reward vendors who use Lumen, L2 operators. It's built on mechanisms that provide monetary autonomy and has proposal reviewed and voted on by people using Lumen. So you hold the Lumen token, you call the shots, not the devs, not the big investors, you call the shots, direct. And votes are weighed, but the community can vote to partially or fully switch to one person, one vote systems. So you can even affect how the voting will go. Not only can you affect voting, but affect the whole process. I don't know of any other system in crypto that I've seen that does that. And then votes are counted automatically. Afterwards, anyone can execute selected policies. And the monetary changes can be implemented in multiple steps and vote on by the community. Why Lumen? It fixes previous crypto key design issues. And a major currency has to be able to be worked by money spenders and receivers. And sometimes there's an issue where the money spender, as a result, would use alternatives or something like that. And that doesn't really work. That's kind of problematic for the crypto industry. And we've seen how that happens. But given old projects were designed, Lumen could have the best monetary properties and policies. They'll have the Newt Conceptus, Providence Favors Undertakings. It's a Latin text. 
You can see in the meme triangle, Nick in favor of different undertakings and Lumen's ready to provide more transparency than, you know, your typical banking system. It could be the best for the crypto economy, especially what's going on as the world economy grows at three to 4% each year. Almost all cryptos are deflationary in nature. So we can see the moon map quarter three of 2022. There will be a launch. Then we also have the reward, rewarding pools that are preset to start in July and last two years. The governance, which is the big thing, will be set in launch. The voting start later in 2023, so get excited for that. Once we get into next year, at the time of recording this video, we're in quarter three of 2022. Develop the ecosystem, bring it into the metaverse, the first central banking session, and a new era. I'm really excited about this. I think this is going to be a revolutionary way to handle the DAO. So why Lumen, a currency, as I said, needs both spenders and receivers. How does it work? They're going to have a central banking session, as I talked about here. And it's going to be held once every year around June 9th and lasts for 10 days. And the frequency of the session is set so that Lumen members will not need to monitor governance too frequently. And what are the two rewarding pools for? They're set up for two years to ensure a fairer distribution. What happens as the two pools ended after two years depending on whether lumen will be bridged on sidechain at that time the community will vote during the annual banking session how do you get in contact them you can hit them up on the telegram or the discord or the right corner of the website now a lot of their time is spent developing this thing and this is going to be really exciting so let's check out some of their social media so first thing you want to check out is the lumen coin as we can see they have a ton of members here and a lot of people online it has a website and all the information. You can find them LumenCoin at Telegram and click here to view them on Telegram. Then also the big one, the Discord with what is Lumen, the rules, anything Lumen related, the lounge, and all the information you have here. Also, this is going to talk about everything you'll need to know in the pink sales in about three weeks and go to Uniswap to be locked just for some good information. So make sure to hit the Telegram and the Discord as recommended. So we've talked about Lumen. I think this is really cool. One meme to rule them all. Will this be the one DAO to rule them all? I think it has. The one crypto monetary mechanism to rock the world. Maybe that's why they call it the Illuminati or Lumen. And we can see the tokenomics and the pink sale link here if you are interested. That does it for this review. I'm really excited for their prospect of DD DAO. I'm going to see how this unfolds. I think it's a very, very interesting concept of direct democracy. But I'd love to hear your thoughts. So if you enjoyed this review, smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell to know when I post more videos. Also, if you got any questions or comments, what do you think of this project? Let me know down below. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you in the next one.